Back to the phone zoo, Albertville, Alabama. This is Jody, and I'm glad you waited. Welcome. Happy to have you here on the EIB Network. Hello. Miss Linda? Yeah. I can't believe it. Ah. How are you? <laughs> it's been years. I've been, I've been listening to you for years. I feel like you're one of my best friends. Well, I am. Yes, you are. We all um, are best friends here. <laughs> yeah. Um, I just wanted to get off my And I just want you, if you are ever accused of sexual harassment, I will not believe it. Thank you, because I would not do that. Some women do, though. Really? Sure. <laughs> but anyway, I called to say that I am voting for Judge Roy Moore, and I'm so mad at Republicans that I could spit nails. They're such wimps. They, they, you know, they said that they're just going to take these women's word for it because they have no reason to doubt them. When, you know, women do, sometimes it's a dirty little secret. Sometimes women use sex to get what they want. Really? Yeah. Hmm. <laughs> but anyways, um, <laughs> <laughs> it's true. It's true. I'm sorry. I'm so excited I can't even keep my train of thought. Well, what what is it? The, the, the thing here with Roy Moore, correct me <laughs> if I'm wrong, but the allegations against him are 40 years old, right? Yes. You know, 40 years ago, women in Georgia could get married when they were 14. I did not know that. I, yeah. Yeah. Yep, I had one right at my house at Thanksgiving. Was married in Georgia when she was 14. Is she still, not that it's good. Is she still married? Uh, actually, she was married for oh, a lot of years, but he passed away a few years ago. Oh, okay. Well, yeah. here's the thing. Uh, you find it fascinating that while they're just going to town, everybody on you know what a reprobate Roy Moore is. That while that's all of these Democrats are dropping like flies. I'll tell you what. Before they even even uh, the picture with uh, Al Franken came out, and they were talking about Roy Moore. And in my mind, I'm thinking they have Al Franken up there. I mean, really. They're gonna. They're not gonna let us have Roy Moore. These Republicans say they're gonna try to not seat Roy Moore, and they've got Al Franken up there. I mean, everybody knew he was sleazy even before the pictures came out. Yeah. Well, this is an insider versus uh, outsider thing again. Uh, Roy Moore is considered persona non grata simply because of his ideology, and they think he's a kook. You know, he he's uh, devoted to the Ten Commandments. He does weird things you know, like that, and people are made nervous by it in the uh, in the establishment. But it is kind of ironic. Look, the latest polling data that we had out of Alabama was yesterday, and it was a poll that has, I think there are three previous releases of this poll, and it's, I, I can't remember the name of the polling outfit right now, but it seems to be taken seriously there. And he's a five-point lead. And, you know, your re, your reaction to this, uh, Jody, how many people do you think are, are – are, there's, there, there's a backlash. All of this piling on Roy Moore is actually causing more people to maybe look positively at him, maybe think about voting for him. Yeah, I, I agree with that totally because, uh, well, we're just sick of being pushed around. We're sick of it. I, I tell you what, uh, I lived in Georgia years ago, and Newt, Newt Gingrich was my representative. Right. And then he had that big scandal, and they got rid of him. And I was mad. And then uh, Larry McDonald was my representative, and he got shot down out of the sky. And now Roy Moore, I want him in. Yeah, and that was K- me K-A-L-007. That was, a, he was, uh, that was over the Kamchatka Peninsula. The Soviet Union shot down that airplane. Korean Airlines 007. Anyway, Jody, thank you for the call. Appreciate the feedback. We've got to take a timeout and be right back.